Remember this? Do you know which movie it's from? When we watch scary movies, what we hear is almost as important as what we see. Music can keep us in suspense, make us hold our breath, and even make us scared. But how do you create music that makes us feel this way? Damn, this is some scary shit! I'm going to play you a movie clip and you tell me how you feel as you watch it. Ayo, I really feel so anxious, Eddie. <laughs> I am scared. So how did you feel? Uh, very anxious, very tense. Something is coming, something is coming, something is coming again. The sound just got louder and I was just like, can I like mute it? So, why does such music make us feel this way? Because we are conditioned to hear happy things and harmonious things. So anything that falls out of that category, it basically unnerves every fibre of your being. This is Weyong. He's a film composer who has written music for horror and thriller movies. And he also won the Golden Horse Award for his music score in the film A Land Imagined. So Weyong, what is it about these soundtracks that make them so unnerving to listen to? It's unnerving because notes clash and we hear dissonance. Basically, it's chaos. Just imagine pulling a rubber band, never knowing when it's going to snap. That's exactly the kind of anxiety that you can evoke with dissonance. When it comes to dissonant chords, there is one particularly awful sounding chord that we've heard in alarms, sirens, metal music, and even... And is infamously known as the Devil's Interval. The Devil's Interval is one of the most jarring and clashing combination of notes. It is two notes played by five semitones apart. You can hear it in films like Seven, Friday the 13th, the Shining. Yikes. In fact, so unsettling it was that the chord was rumoured to have been banned from being played in churches from the Middle Ages. But how exactly do you create tension with a music score? If you didn't already know, A Land Imagined, the movie that Wei Yong won his award for, is a mystery film about the disappearance of a construction worker. And for that, he created some music pieces that were pretty uncomfortable to listen to. So how do you do that, Wei Yong? The whole aim is to create something as abrasive as possible. So it is the equivalent of the nail on the chalkboard. For the ocean scene, it was basically a combination of very low frequency notes and high frequency notes that are clashing against each other like torn lovers. And it just created hell. In this case, it's not notes. They are more like sound effects like thumps and booms. it automatically creates a feeling of stress and doom. But we don't always have to use music to create suspense, right? What if there was no sound at all? Sometimes utter complete silence can really invoke a sense of discomfort. There is a moment. When you feel like you're there in the moment with no music to guide you or spoon feed you, you're just kind of there like witnessing it unfold in front of you. Obviously, you will be more immersed and you, the audience themselves, will create the tension that's needed. Here's a challenge for you. Do you think you can make one of our videos into a horror movie? Yeah, I think I can. That's how you achieve suspense, my friends! <laughs>